Hey, good evening. So hey, check this out. So, last night I made this video. I was totally laying down meditating. I, you know, I don't know. I was totally, I, I love cartoons. I'm totally a little kid at heart, totally. But, um, so I'm letting this cartoon play. And literally I'm just kind of, you know, just, you know, I use, it helps because there's always going to be distractions in the world. If you can meditate with things going on around you, then, you know, you're good. You know, you can normally stay pretty balanced and patient in times of, you know, stress, you know, but not often, not always the case, but you know what I mean? Like, that's the, that's the point of it to be able to build a tolerance to that, but moving on. So I came to find that, okay, when we move on from this world, Okay, we come to this world from a spiritual world, from another realm. We take part in this realm, in the, in the flesh, in the material. But then we move on from this realm into another non-material realm. Or is there material there? Your guess is as good as mine right now. I, I'm not sure about material versus immaterial. I just know that it's outside of the realm of our perception here visually there's other ways to be able to to interact with the other realms it's just not a visual normally for some people it is the it's a gift or a curse depending on how you look at it but it can be pretty confusing ask a schizo i bet you know, I don't know. I, I often wonder, but I often wonder about the negative polarity versus the positive polarity. The schizo, you know, in negative polarity or the schizo in positive polarity where it's a blessing. You know what I mean? You know, there's, unfortunately, it's looked at of one of two ways. It's either mental psychosis or it's a spiritual and spiritual gift that blesses the whole world. You know what I mean? It's one of the two. So, but I found that it was revealed to me that we move from glory to glory as does our Father before us and does Christ go before us and, you know, makes the way and prepares the place before us. He goes and he, pre he prepares the way for us in each realm. In each realm. He goes before us in each realm. That's where he's been going. And, and, and it's up to us to be Christ here now to follow after him with our cross and to bear our cross until we gain our crown. That's that's what this place is about because he's already gone. He's already gone to the next glory. He's preparing the way for us there. We need to be fulfilling the work here as the body. You know what I mean? And as we transition from glory to glory, see next next we get to be it's kind of like a guardian angel thing, you know? I don't know, we get to look out for our loved ones here. You know, I don't know, there's it's, it's a multifaceted thing. I just know that that's one of the jobs. I just know that that's one of the cool gigs we get. You know, we get to watch over our loved ones here, you know, and make sure things don't happen to them. But you know, you know, they earned their wings for the next realm, post the next realm from here, you know what I mean? In the third realm from here. Hop one over. You know, they get their, they get their wings like in the next realm. You know, by like fighting off a, uh, another, you know, entity that, that, you know, wants to impose will on another entity, but the angel, but the entity has, but the being has a guardian angel, right? Well, the guardian angel will fight that other entity, say the other entity wins, you know what I mean? Well, that will is going to be imposed on the being that that angel was protecting, pretty sure, unless the father, son's other, you know, demons otherwise, but... Still, nonetheless, okay, but check this out. So, that, the one that gave their life, do you think, you know, there's a reward for him in the next realm waiting, right? You know what I mean? Christ already went and paved the way and prepared the way there and made a place. So, you know what I mean? They'll be welcomed there into the next life. Just like all of us who will go afterward. But we, by the way that we live the life, we choose how we will go into the next. 
That is serious stuff right there. Think about what we give our lives to. It will, it will have an effect on how we enter the next life and the reasons why we enter the next life, the tasks that we will have, the lessons we will have, everything, everything. But what I really wanted to emphasize was that, you know, we transition from glory to glory, as does our Father, as does Christ before us. And it's like gaining your wings, being able to transition into the next life, being granted access to the next life. It's not just about being, you know, well, man, that sucks. They died. They, I wish they would have just stayed alive. No, be joyful for them. Quit mourning. They were allowed access to the next life. They, they were allowed to go. You know what I mean? Like, everything's for a purpose. God is really in control. Seriously, there's actually no evil in the world. Think about that. If our God is everything, our God is all things, and there is no darkness in him, then how could anything in this world, which is made up of him, be evil? That would mean that there would be evil within our Father. That would mean that some part of our Father is evil. There is no evil. Evil is, a, evil is an illusion. It really is. It really is. You guys are so much more than what you know. All of you. But you have to find that for yourself because only you know what that is. I don't even know what that is. I hope everybody finds... Oh, you know what? Everybody does find it in their own time. In their own life. It just may not be this life. And so, but we all search. It's placed within us all to search, though. God, such a beautiful sunset. Well, anyways, hey, you know, I love you guys, and it's totally my greatest pleasure to be able to share my puzzle piece with everybody. I'm so blessed, so blessed to be able to have to the opportunity to. I hope. My only hope is that it inspires others to share their peace as well. Because me sharing my peace does nothing if everybody isn't going to come and share theirs too, right? Well, that's the whole point of it. There's so much we can do. There's so much we're meant to do. Holy crap. Oh, man. Yeah, I'll save that for another video. Okay, you guys have a great rest of your evening. Enjoy the rest of your week. It's Wednesday. It's hump day. They say all the BS rolls downhill on Wednesday. Just please don't get caught at the bottom of the hill. <laughs> it's almost Friday. It's the great thing about Wednesday. And shoot, you know, just take it one day at a time. It doesn't matter what day it is. Just enjoy each day for what it is. Do what makes your heart sing. If it doesn't make your heart sing, don't do it. Say no. Turn it down. Say I can't. I don't want to. Just do what makes your heart sing. And watch how your life changes. Watch how... <laughs> Watch how life becomes life instead of existence. Go live your life. Go love yourself and love others. It's the best advice I could give anyone. 
God bless you all. Christ be with you.